Tucson was almost born as an end line. While we were designing the base car, uh, before even thinking about the, the sporty version, we all noticed that it, it had naturally become so sporty that we had to calm the game. And while doing this, we already had actually the elements to spice it up for the, for the endline version. So we only simply made it more stable, improved the stance of the vehicle by, and by playing with the horizontal elements, and also by pushing the elements as far out as possible to really emphasize the stance of the vehicle. The grille became more horizontal, and all the details, while darkening them, also became uh, from a less triangular and more trapezoidal shape. So that, that all contributed to this more, let's say, uh, muscular perception you have from the car. The first thing you will notice uh, while looking at the side is the integration of all the, the contrasted parts uh, in body color. With this, we basically um, put the emphasis on less utility and more sports. We highlighted the lightweight character of the, of the wheel by reducing the amount of diamond cut elements. So you will notice the, the contrasting elements are much th uh, thinner, emphasizing the, 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 the dark aspect of the wheels to give a bit more of a dominant role to the, to the technical elements of the car, like the, like the brakes. Uh, that was important for us. We horizontalize all the elements on the lower part of the bumper, uh, pushing them to the extremes of the side. On the interior, you will see mainly the trim, which has been the red stitching, the darkening of the elements as well, in order the sportier uh, contoured seats. All the elements are basically giving you an atmosphere of uh, what I would call a professional atmosphere. We don't want to be racy, we want to, to, to give a feeling of a professional tool, which is, which is precise, which is sharp, which is the perfect um, companion for the, for, for the job.
Leonio Tucson also the Tucson Island has plenty of human oriented technologies. For example, the fully digital cockpit features a 10.25 open cluster without a hood and a large infotainment touchscreen for an intuitive and an high tech user experience. As uh, the, the Onyo Tucson, also Tucson Island has the most comprehensive safety package in its class. It features a system like the Highway Driving Assist, uh, which is a system that can automatically adapt the speed for every incoming bends on the highway while upon exiting from the curb, the speed will come back to the preset level. Another example of feature unique to this segment is the blind spot view monitor, which shows in the supervision cluster the rear side of uh, the car when the driver is activating the turning signal. Those are just two examples, but there are plenty of other safety features who can help the driver in preventing from collision or improving visibility. The Tucson Airline features uh, indirect uh, air vents with uh, multi-air mode technologies. This system uh, creates uh, indirect air flow while keeping the overall uh, wind volume stable in the cabin. When it comes to powertrains, the Tucson Airline will be available with uh, diesel and gasoline with 40 volts mild hybrid as option hybrid and plug-in hybrid variant. I would say that next to their 265 PS plug-in hybrid and the 230 PS hybrid version, the 180 PS 1.6 turbo GDI 48 volts mild hybrid is definitely a highlight too.